Antioch Day family and friends held a prayer vigil today to remember and honor the lives of the four victims. It's been two years now and still no arrest in this case. The writings on this house tell a story of pain, loss, and grief. These was three mothers. These was three daughters. These was three sisters, aunts, and a nephew, and a young man. Family and friends returned to the place where four people were found shot and killed on the two-year anniversary of the crimes. The hurt, a whole family, took four of them. Slain. It happened on March 24, 2015, inside this house. Police arrived on scene to find the bodies of Tierra Turner, Sherry Taylor, Terry Bettis, and her son, Davon Whitlock. Police believe someone forced their way into the home and ransacked the place. I just want whoever knows anything. Just go forward and say something, please. For Taylor Bettis, the pain <laughs> is unbearable. I think that was your mommy. That was my, I was, that was my mom. <laughs> And my brother, that these people that took away. For Ivory Smith, she wants to know why. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard. I lost my mom for nothing. She don't live over here. She don't hang out over here. She wasn't supposed to be here. She, like many others here today, are just hoping that someone will come forward with information. These people are hurting our families. They're breaking up. <laughs> our lives they, they tearing it up and these people are out here protecting them you know like it just don't make sense